Hey guys, so, um, sorry for the echo in my bathroom because I'm making a video on how to clean your conch piercing. Um, I got one yesterday, literally yesterday, and, um, that's what a conch piercing is, if you don't know. And, um, I'm going to show you how to clean it, how I clean it. Um, there's like four different ways to clean it. Um, first way is I use this stuff, hydrocortisone. Um, I use this in the mornings whenever I wake up. It stops the itching and all that other good stuff, and... It's really good for like cartilage type piercings because they prevent keloids and if you have one, it gets rid of them. Um, so this is really good for it. Um, you just put it on a Q-tip and you know the drill. The second way is I just get it when I get in the shower, I run hot water through it. Make sure it gets all the crusts out and all that good stuff. Um, the third way I do it is I use this stuff, I'm not quite sure. pre parathician I don't know. I'm not a genius. But this stuff, this stuff is amazing. It brings down, what does it do? Uses, excuse me, um, temporary relief, irritation, breathing. Oh, no. Um, it promotes cool relief, painful burning and itching, shrink swollen, and external discomfort. So this is really good for piercings. Um... So this is what I recommend the most, and also H2 Ocean. Those two things, I don't have any because I'm poor. But I just found this in my medicine cabinet, and um, I guess I can show you how to clean it. So you want to open up the cap, and it's going to look like this clear gel crap. You want to get a Q-tip and just... Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Um, you want to get some on there. Oh my god, a little bit too much. And you want to... Put it around the piercing. Like so. And then you want to flip the other end over, get some more, and easily go around the back. And this is kind of tricky, but whatever. And then, ooh, I got some crust. That's delicious. Yeah, don't pick the crust, um, oh no, um, don't pick the crust, don't twist it, don't move it, you don't have a really bad habit at that, but if you have any questions, I'll be doing it all about this piercing, once it's a little more healed, and I can, you know, show you guys better, so I hope this helped, and I'll see you later guys, bye guys.